I say we go after it. Finish the job. Anyone ever tell you you're scary? Yes. I mean, there's obviously a way out up there, which is exactly what we need. Plus, it'll give us eyes on where we need to go. It is settled. Let's scale this down contraption. Yeah, okay. How do we do that? Good question. Like there's one of those vintage workbench things back here. Wouldn't surprise me. Maybe someone was trying to fix up the old bomber. Okay, Rocky, let's see if this thing still works. Yeah, all right. Just better not get jumped by any monsters. And it's done. I wouldn't trust a thing you said. We agree for once. I too would prefer Peter Quill's incompetence to the rodent's lies. The reactor thing there is pretty loose. And pretty gunked up. Ugh. Yo, Quill! Check out the upper wing strut! Looks pretty compromised to me! Gamora, how high up this thing can you climb? Let's find out! Are you relishing this moment, assassin? What moment? Visiting the grave of your enemies. No, the core weren't my enemies, Drax. They were my father's enemies. See anything useful up there? I got eyes on this gunked up reactor. A couple of shots to bring it down. All right, pretty sure that baby's our ticket upward. Somehow. It is neither a baby nor a ticket. It is a reactor. Drax, moving that thing around ain't a problem, right? It is not. Just like the mighty Lady Hellbender, I am exceptionally muscular. We got it, Drax. This unit is tremendously heavy. I thought you were exceptionally muscular. What next, Peter Quill? What's that I hear? The wing cables calling down to us? They want a date with your sword, Gamora. This brings back memories! Impressive. See? That was easy. Great teamwork, everyone. I am Groot. I helped in spirit. <laughs> All right. Slippery wind pummel treetops, here we come. You know, I uh, really admire our team's commitment to safety. One thing is clear. We would never have accomplished this task without the assassin. Did Drax just praise Gamora? I am giving credit where credit is due. Took you long enough. We all know Gamora's super cool and super valuable. And she has not yet tried to kill us. How come you never give me credit? Like he said, he gives credit for credit to do. <clears throat> Need your muscles again, Drax. I will drop it where you command. Over there. As you wish. Drax? What purpose does it serve over here? You'll see, you'll see. Just be patient. No giant monster. All good. There it is! Lady Hellbender's fortress! It's got bigger, that for sure. Ha! It is not getting bigger. We are getting closer. Thanks, Drax. Looks like there's a way down here. Quill, you gotta see this ship. Behold, Lady Hellbender's wrath. Even the Chitauri feared her. What's Captain distracted up to now? If he calls us over, I'm done. 
Whoa, 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 guys! There's this totally sweet pile of crap on the ground. So interesting. Let's all stick our fingers in it. I can hear you downwind. I can hear you downwind. Okay, here we go. Oh, slimy. Uh, guys. You might want to wait to come down here. Oh, why the flark is so deep? In a jam, boys? Uh, you think? Some schmack reach! Sword will not work, woman. Find us a rope. Yeah, hit fast. Where am I supposed to find a rope? I don't know. I'm sinking in jelly here. Well, do something! Like what? Flark, flark, flark. Quill. Quill. <laughs> I don't know. My blasts, they... I've only done that once before when I was a kid. I don't do it on purpose. Classic Spartoi tech. Just when you think you've seen it all, it pulls scut like this. Just, come on, dude. Just... Please, the let guns me, alone! Let me... I, I, well, I just want to see how they tick. Otherwise, it might as well be magic. Or sorcery. Guys! DNA Is it kind of morphing an Or sorcery. Here we go again. Come on! 
up and over. Ding, ding, ding! Give that man a gold star! Let's figure out how to make it climbable. Stars are made of hydrogen, not gold. The inflammatory. Barely any power. Maybe we can muscle those cannons out. It would give us some steps to climb. Worth Drax, think you can drag this cannon out? I will try it. More stubborn than expected! Impossible! It will not stay in place! You couldn't... Drax, can you try again? Why? It does not stay. I'm working it out. Trust me. I cannot hold it forever! Now we gotta get the next one out. Rocket, I need you to squeeze inside that little hole and try to knock the gun loose from the inside. Hello, Shatari ship full of booby traps and death mechanisms. But you love both those things. Uh, you're right, I do. And I always wanted to see the inside of one of these bug bombers. Fine. in here. That's... Oh, Scott. Ah! Are you okay in there, Rocket? I found the crew. I guess not even the worms want to eat dead Shatari meat. Rocket. Relax. Just gonna reroute a little bit of remaining power to the cannon and... Nothing. You know what? Clark it. I'm blowing it up. What? Hang on. Think about all the booby traps and... Gamora, can you clear us a path through that junk? Sure. Yes, Peter Quill. Onward to the palace of the great giantess. Oh, so she's a giantess now. Oh, man. Another murder tentacle. Careful. It might be playing dead. Uh. Uh. That is not a happy monster. Well, at least it left. Oh, on. Why is the bridge always on the wrong side? This time I insist we hurl the foul beast. And I insist we push muscles over the side of the cliff. To what end? Yours! You are dead! He'll be fine. Just curl up in a ball. What? Drax, throw him. Very well. No! Wait, wait! Peter. It's okay. He'll land on his feet. Uh, I guess that only applies to... Cats. You sons of dogs! Scut busting ass bladders! I am not familiar with these Filthy words. Filthy grunt scum! I think he's making them up, but he's blocks. really pissed. You can rot, you at free least he's not shooting at us. Holes. He missed on purpose, right? Order the beast to do its job. Rocket, come on, man! Cram it, dast face! Fix the bridge and we'll raise your cut by 5%. I want ten. Okay, deal. We'll take it out of Groot's cut. He doesn't understand money anyway. Astute fire. Either she will want to be a seller. I'm with the war on this. Look in the part is happening. The fortress is this way, Peter Quill. I know. I'm just doing some exploring. Ain't we done enough of that already? I'm pretty sure exploring is code. It means you went the wrong way, but it's too stubborn to admit it. In that case, Quill's the greatest explorer I ever met. Yeah, just, you know, during 
some water into ice. Go off. I think I can see my house from here. What are you doing up there? Scout type stuff. Scouting. Looks like we uh need to keep going towards the fortress and not away from it. Excellent work. Beast ain't running back to mommy to tell on us. Should have aimed for its head, Gamora. At least I took an appendage. What did you do? Thanks for the bridge, Rocket. If you even think of pulling that scum. Okay, that's kind of weird. Hello? Anybody? <laughs> Whoa! Oh! Oh! Okay, that got my <clears throat> blood pumping. Why would Lady Hellbender cage this creature? Uh, because it's annoying as scud. Perhaps it is food. That thing's food? Yes, monster food. I wonder what it tastes like. Peter! Why would it taste like that? I can use this. You know, we really got Monster gotta food? Your taste the cage! You get it? We need the cage. Taste we go into that fortress with our, with our monster peacefully walking beside us. We'll be laughed right out of the room. Why are you whispering? Two more thinks we can sell our monster act better if we have a proper cage. Only problem is, there's a pissed off monster inside. Release the beast, let me dispose of it. Because that worked so well for you last time. We need a better plan of attack. Yes. Ideally, one that guarantees my safety is needed. Listen, this isn't our first rodeo, guys. Problem is, if we play it cocky, one little mistake is gonna bring us down. So let's get back out there, give this fight complete dedication, and make them scream! Who's with me? Die, scene! We are! Oh, yeah!
heading back up! More! Come to me, peace! <laughs> you are coming with me. We better hurry. I am Groot. I think that's it, big guy. They won't be bothering us no more. So, what do we do if all don't go well with Lady A? Are we gonna fight a monster queen? She would be a formidable adversary indeed. Lady Hellbender isn't her adversary. If all goes well, she's gonna be our business partner. And if all don't go well? Then we'll know we should have sold Groot instead. Groot. Groot says we should check things out over here. Groot, give me a bridge here. The fortress is right on the other side of those cliffs. Pretty short. Deep freeze. Oh, can I try ice cubing something? Nope. Man, you're such a gas flat. So if we're gonna haggle with the monster queen, how much are we asking for our monster? 395 million units, give or take two. One for every precious hair follicle on this flawless body. You have counted them. Hey, at least I have some to count. Snucknarf oh, ain't never heard of roads? You'd have to clear parts of the jungle to do it, which would probably mean killing some of the wildlife. Good. They deserve it. Snucknarf 9 is a sanctuary. They say that if you... Behind a single piece of refuse, Lady Hellbender will personally return it to you. In the most unpleasant way. That can't be true. That thing heavy twelve. Surprisingly light. If we put our monster in it, would he shrink as well? Uh, no, it would compress anything inside to a mound of twitching gore. <laughs> Neat. Don't get any ideas. Whoa, that is definitely in my top ten fortresses. moderately amusing. Now we've got a ticking time bomb on the ship. Ugh. We just can't catch a break. There's always some stupid blah monster or angry space cops or a random ship explosion kicking us in the teeth. And the weather always sucks. It does. I'm wet and hungry and angry, but damn it, I'm not about to lose this deal after everything we've been through. So I'm gonna march into that ridiculously awesome palace and try to sell the crap out of one of my valued team members. Because I think we've all earned that chance. I am eager to behold the Master Queen. No, it ain't. What did the tree say? Let's just get this done. Okay. It's for 
farther than it looked. Much farther. It's a fucking infinity bridge, is what it is. Are uh, you being dramatic, Rodent? Bridge ends at the fortress, therefore it is not infinite. Yeah, that's super comforting. Guess we gotta go. Three cycles. Peter? Aren't you forgetting something? Are you Oh! Right! Cage. The point of even getting the Flarkin thing is looking like we mean business. All right, Rocket. Time to put on your monster face. I only got one face, Quill. Are you sure about this, Peter? <laughs> Look at him! You better have one hell of a sales pitch. Remind me again. How many missions have we been on so far? Thirteen. Fourteen, if you count Contraxia. Contraxia was not a mission. It was a mistake. All right. Point is, is I was able to sell you. Gamora, daughter of Thanos, intergalactic assassin. As a hero. Fourteen times! <laughs> Fine. I think he's made his point. <laughs> Drat. Gamora, can you help me with no. this? What? Why? To guarantee your safety as our leader. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> She's got you there, Quill. Now shut up and start pulling. Will you stop worrying so much? You're gonna start growing knots again. Okay, here we go. Stuck in a flarkin cage, please. <sighs> Does anybody have like a campfire song or something we can sing to kill the time? Ooh, ooh, I know one. It's called. Please stop. All right, yeah. Okay. Wait, is please stop the name of your song? No. Okay. So, how long before someone else wants to pull this thing? We are 60 clicks from the fortress. I'd say closer to 75. Well, there is only one way to know for sure. 0 0.1 clicks. 0 0.2 clicks. 0 0.9. 2.1. 0 0.3 clicks. 4.5. 0 0.4 clicks. 0 0.5 clicks. clicks. 13 whole years. Look at you. Where does time go? I'll be up in a sec, I promise. Right. 